Hello everybody, it's the evil bunny Chris Okatsuna here. Today I am not anybody in particular, I am just a evil looking toy bunny, um, like a stuffed animal, that's why I have these uh, uh, stitch marks on my face, because I'm just an evil bunny. Um, instead of being a cute fluffy bunny, I'm an evil bunny. Um, today uh, is the next installment of Scaretober. We only basically have an, like one more week plus uh, the actual Halloween day. Um, so two more games essentially. Um, if you haven't heard of this game, it is called Vanish as you can see. Uh, basically you are like in a sewer tunnel or a bunch of like a maze of sewer tunnels and you have to find um, a set of keys and something else and get out of there with your life because there's also a monster in in the cave um or cave in the sewers now markiplier has played this game many of times and he has tried to beat it and every single time he has gotten both components that he needs to get out the monster gets him and he's had like a, a lot of people show him like hey this game is beatable you can beat it but he just can't seem to beat it or he technically sort of beat it but it didn't really count because I don't remember. I think the monster caught him right at the very end, but he says he he uh, won, but I'm saying he didn't. Um, so this is going to be my attempt to at playing Venice. Now I had to bump the uh, the brightness up on it because otherwise I wouldn't be able to see it because with this light flash or er, shining in my eyes, um, I'm not really able to see a whole lot of anything. Um, so without further ado, we're going to see what we can do. Hopefully I can see, which I can't very well. Okay, so we're at this door. And now it's super bright. And the door opens. Because before I couldn't see a diddly darn thing. And I get tossed into here. Okay, sweet. This is not in any way, shape, or form my idea of a good time. <laughs> I don't like chasing being chased or whatever, so that's going to be... Uh, okay, luckily I can use control to crouch. Good, I can use that control. Alright. Alrighty. Um, so basically we just... Do you have a flashlight? Um, shift to run, can I use that shift? Okay, good. Everything's on this side, so everything's on the right, the mouse key and whatnot. Um, so I want to use the run as less of, uh, less, uh, as less that I need to, not as much as I need to or something. Okay, so... Um, just be warned that I'm probably going to die a whole hell of a lot. Because I still can't totally see, because all I see right now is like this area of my chest. Um, because of the reflection of the laptop screen. Um, the lights do help when I'm near them. But otherwise I can't see. There's a miner's hat. Or a worker's hat there. Don't you look, get like uh, glow sticks or something? Which I don't think helps a whole heck of a lot either, so. So we'll play this and probably die. Well, let's keep going straight, I guess. I have my mouse like way over here because I'm using the other laptop as kind of like a mouse. Because with this new uh, microphone here, it's not. Uh, uh, it doesn't leave a lot of space to use the mouse. So there was an arrow pointing this way. So I guess we still go straight. I'm expecting a jump scare any moment, like a... There it is. 
Did I call that or what? And then the sounds start. Okay, you can go out of tunnel vision now. Was I just here? This where it's like kind of like a. It says it when I was reading the description. It says it proce procedural. It changes. So. This is where I started. So I went that way. To just end up back at the start. Okay, so. We'll go this way. Okay, here's a letter. It says, there's something definitely following me. I swear if that's you, Phil, I'm gonna kill you. Okay, I don't need to pick that up. As far as I know, which is a letter to read, which I've read, because it's there on the wall. Okay, so. We'll go through this holy thing here. I have not seen any sign of the monster yet, which is either fortuitous or not. Probably not. So we got two ways to go. We can either go this way or this way. I'll go this way. It's been a while since I've seen anybody play this game, so... Another thing, so I'll just go this way. I don't remember the tunnels being this long, though. I thought there were just like passages between the walls. So there's a dead in here. Uh, see something crawling to the dirt tunnel? Want to go there if I were you? A little giant rat or something weird. So can they go into the tunnel? The monster. I don't remember that part either. Boop, 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 boop. Back that ass up. Get back in the hole. So we saw the monster. And it was coming towards us. But I think the main problem a lot of people have is they turn around and run. And I don't think you're supposed to run. I think you're just supposed to calmly and casually back that ass up and get the fuck out of there. Because otherwise, he's gonna hear your footsteps and come running after you. You notice I just backed up and went back in the hole. He didn't see me or hear me, so I actually don't think he can hear or see. So he goes by sound. So I think like a lot of the problem is like people will uh, run away from him and end up getting caught because they're running and they're making a lot of noise. Hank, where are you? Are you getting my notes? I don't even know. Where I am, I think there's something down here with us. I'm still looking for the water pump room to help us look for your keys. So you need keys, and I thought you need something else too. Keys and something else. To get out. But we're still wandering around. There's a map. Supposedly. But, oh, hello there, friend. I'm just gonna go this way, okay? He's just sitting there. Money on the business. Oh. Okay. That was a little jump scary there. I notice I'm walking a little faster, sort of. Maybe that's just because the walls uh, changed. The the sight changed perspective. So so far we've seen the monster twice. We've seen the monster twice, and haven't gotten caught by him. But eventually, I'm gonna have to end the episode, so I'm gonna have to let him kill me at least once. So... That's the thing. But we're just gonna keep going. I mean, 
I don't really like games where things chase you. Um, but in this particular case, yeah, he's gonna chase you, but he's gonna kill you, regardless. If he corners you, he's gonna be there. And he'll kill you, and he'll make you have to start the game over. So, there's another note here. Phil, I don't know what ha just happened. I s snuck up right behind me. I knew I was gonna die, so I just stood there. I don't think it could see me. Stay safe. So it goes on the same vein as I said. It doesn't see, it hears. So when you turn around and run away, that's when it comes to get you. I'm like kind of like oh, stoic right now. I'm just kind of. See, I saw him and I'm backing up. I'm gonna turn around and I'm gonna walk off slowly. Because I think that's the main problem. People automatically think, oh, it's a monster. It's going to come after me, so run. No. If you see the monster, stop. Back that ass up. And just walk away. Just as calmly and, and casually as you can. Uh, don't know what just snuck up my head. Okay, that's what we had before. So, these walls and things change. Okay, there he is again. So I'm just gonna back that ass up, turn around, go back the other way, and go down this way. <sighs> Sorry if there's any lag or any, like, glitchy type things, because every once in a while there's, like, a sound glitch. I have no idea what that is or how to fix it. Um, apparently it still happens when I have this microphone, so I don't know why it's happening. It just does. Okay, so there's some steam there. Uh, Phil, I don't know what happened. Okay, that's the same goddamn letter we've seen already. Three times, this is the third time. Some reason I think I'm kind of like going around a circle. Okay, there he is, over there. So I'm just gonna go this way. I mean, like I said, if I don't find anything, like I just seem to be going around in circles. If I don't seem okay, there's the, there's the exit. I'm guessing, which is not gonna be there. when I need it. So it's gonna be a pain in the ass to find it again. Um, here's another letter. Uh, hey, Kate, listen, I saw it. I saw it. I think it was just listening for me. I just, it just charged me. I ran. I just ran. Don't let it hear you. See, that's the cue. You don't let it hear you. Otherwise, you're dead. If you turn around and run, that's when it comes and gets you. Okay, so I just went past that back there, and now it's up here again. I, f I sound like I'm like calm and collected and casual and everything like that, which I am in a sort, because I'm like taking this of out of a sort of... Uh, I'm doing things slowly and carefully. So it won't, uh... Okay, so here is some glow sticks. And I'm guessing the keys are in here too? Or it's just the glow sticks that are in here? see no keys, just the glow sticks. So we got s oh. Okay, why isn't that not working? Oh there we go. Oh hello. Ah and I died. Awesome. Well that's the first death. <laughs> um probably I should just go ahead and, and leave the game here. It'll probably take way too long to try and do another um 
run of this, I guess you could say. Um, but that's Vanish. Um, it's uh, indie game. It's free. Um, I don't know if this is the like most updated version. Like I got a lot of games from Game Jolt, and one viewer, uh, when I pulled out S SCP, said that I got the wrong, uh, like older version of it. And I'm sorry if I got like an older version of Vanish or whatever. But this is like I don't have like a lot of money to spend on games, so. Uh, when I do get some extra cash, I usually get like a Steam card and buy something on Steam. But anytime I can find like a free indie game or whatever that's on uh, Game Jolt or something like that, then I'll go ahead and download it, even if it may be an older version like the SCP one was apparently. Um, so sorry about that. If this is an older version, then I'm sorry ahead of time. Um, but we did it in a calculated way. Like, I remember from like a lot of times I was watching Markiplier play this, where when he played this, he like ran every single time and died every single time. And so when I'm watching this and I'm like, so don't run. I was like, you see him? Just back that ass up. Just back that ass up, turn around and go the other direction. That's like the simple like thing that I can think of. Yes, it wasn't that scary because I didn't die like hundreds of times and it wasn't jump scare or whatever. So this is kind of tame, I guess, compared to me, or to me anyway. I mean, if I would have had it on a darker setting and had it like no light here on my face and it wasn't super dark or whatever and creepy, then yeah, probably it would have been a little more scary. And if I went in this blind and didn't know what to do, then yeah, it would have been scarier. But um, going in this, I knew what to expect, so it wasn't that super scary. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and share it with your friends. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and Tumblr too. There, It's there, but I don't really do much with it. Uh, <clears throat> also, if you're interested in some merch, check out the merchandise store at Spreadshirt where you can get a shirt. or a tote bag because that's the only two things that are available right now is shirts and tote bags um, so if you're interested in that go there um, next video will probably will it'll be on Monday but it will probably be um, me doing the eating video so look forward to the, uh, an eating video so look forward to that um, and that's going to be it from the evil bunny uh, evil toy bunny and I will see everybody next time have a spooky day